we are at the NAM convention. We have Andy Cantor and Mike Learn, and we're going to tell you a little about the seven deadly sins. Um, it was back in Nashville when you and I were hanging out and we wanted to do something wild. We said, let's do the seven deadly sins. We thought about a graphic artist that would be the guy to do this. Of course, Mike Learn. And I want to let Mike Learn tell you a little about his inspiration for how he came up with this incredible series here. Well, uh, you know, trying to put an image to a, an abstract thought such as a sin, I had to kind of look in the mirror and realize what I was guilty of all myself and uh, trying to put an image to all that was quite challenging and uh, so I just went down to pecking order of according to Dante and uh, I just banged them out one at a time. I listened to a lot of very aggressive metal. Uh, I wanted to throw a lot of attitude. I know I was borderline offending people, but I figured if you ain't making them think or talk, then you ain't doing your job. So I was real appreciative to have the opportunity to express myself in this fashion without having to worry about being censored in any sort of way. So it's a very vulgar, crude uh, depiction of uh, Dante's uh, Seven Deadly Sins, and I'm stoked that Andy uh, has provided Jackson Charvel with his support and uh, the purchase of the instruments. And, and Mike Cotson uh, for giving the opportunity to do it. Just an extreme. Uh, the deadly sins are uh, just thought of a great theme to make a big statement, uh, playing them live and a lot of attention. The uh, guitars uh, definitely uh, are offensive and rude, as Mike said, and um, they just fit what a metal band makes statements about. It's everything that I wanted to be. Very much appreciate Mike and Mike and Jackson for making this happen. Thank you guys very much. You're welcome, man. My pleasure.